All right, guys, this video is going to compare the standard blades that you get with the new 2020 model. This is the Ego 56 volt select cut, right? It's got double blades. All right, the standard blade that's on here is they call it the premium mulching blade. They also give you in the box a premium bagging blade. Now they say that that bagging blade actually cuts the grass up even smaller. So I'm going to be doing uh, a comparison. I'm going to be emptying out the bags so you can see the premium mulching blade and the premium bagging blade. Okay. Now what I want to do is I want to drop this a little lower than I usually do. I'm going to drop it to three. Okay. Three is going to give me a nice cut and it's going to fill the bag up a little bit more because we're going to be comparing what's in that bag. Also, at the end of the video, I'm going to be talking a little bit more about the blades as well as some of the optional blades you can get that do different things. Okay, hold on tight. Let me start the engine with one hand, which isn't that easy. All right, <laughs> give me one second, guys. Here goes. I'm going to do a nice cut. I'm doing uh, manual push. I'm not doing uh, self propel. All right. Okay, I'm going to stop because I'm only doing one cut. Okay, I'm not going to go back and forth. So, let me take the bag out. And again, not easy to do with one hand. But, you know, I'm just going to do the same strip. So you guys get to see basically how much and how big the pieces of grass are. Okay? So I'm going to leave this one here. All right? And you can take a peek at it in a little bit. But, you know, it does a pretty good job. I lay it out pretty good job of cutting it up but hey the premium bagging blade says it actually does a better job so we'll find out I'll be back I have to switch out the blades and do a cut on the left side so the right side will be the standard blade and the left side will be the premium bagging blade which is included and not installed I'll be back guys okay guys so I am now gonna uninstall the double blade and as you can see, this is the premium mulching blade, right? This is the standard blade. That's the upper blade. And this is the standard premium, they call it mulching blade. This blade is the blade that's included, okay? And it is called the premium bagging blade, all right? And that's what I'm going to be installing. I'm going to take this guy off, put this guy on. Supposedly this guy uh, cuts the grass even more. Okay, so let's see how that goes. All right, so you do need a 9 16 um, attachment for here, whether it be a wrench or if you're going to be using a drill. Okay. Um, and you need an 11 16 for these guys, okay? And they both come off counterclockwise. So I'm going to start with, you know, it's funny. I'm going to start initially with just loosening these two because they are a pain. Um, I've already tried this before. Okay, so let me, uh, let me loosen these guys a little bit. Oh, by the way, when you go to loosen these guys... You've got to put something in here. So you see there's a hole here. Let me zoom in. This hole here is basically made so that um, while you're rewinding these bolts, right, and you're taking these bolts down, uh, basically the, the blade doesn't move, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, they came off a little easier this time because, believe me, I've already been playing with these. They do take a while. All right, so I'm just loosening these guys a little bit. That's all I'm going to do. 
Now I'm going to go ahead and, and basically take off the center. Okay. So, all right. Again, I'm leaving this piece in. But now this might spin just so you'll know. All right. It really doesn't matter, honestly, if it spins. Um, if it does, though, they tell you, go ahead and take and put um, maybe a small one of these guys, just a tiny screwdriver, okay? And it's kind of odd because you actually have to end up holding everything, right? But, um, okay, so this is almost off now. I should be able to manually take it off. So, yeah, okay, so here goes. Now, normally they want you wearing gloves and glasses, so be aware of that. I am wearing glasses, I'm not wearing gloves. I'm going to be careful, I'm not going to really play with the blade. All right, so let's go ahead and take off the nut. Let's take off the washer that holds it on the top. All right, and I'm going to take this off, and now what I'm going to do... Give me a second, as I'm now going to work on loosening these guys. Uh, all right, so 11 sixteenths. All right, just get these guys loose. Again, counterclockwise. I know some people think these actually loosen clockwise. I thought that earlier, to be honest with you. So, um, yep. So let me make sure they're locked. All right. All right, guys. I know you're probably like, hey, let me see what you're doing. But all I'm doing right now is taking these nuts off, okay? I did loosen them earlier, which is good because they make my life a lot easier right now. Okay. That is one. I don't have any fancy music on my channel. But uh, I might work on that. <laughs> but I know a lot of you guys were requesting different things. So, you know, um, I'm splitting this up into three videos and then I'm going to uh, connect them. So you guys get to see the cuts. Um, you get to see. So now, again, this, this comes off. Okay. This blade goes, as it says, this, uh, as you can see, this side facing the grass. So... I'm going to go ahead and put it on like that, okay, alright, get the nuts on, okay, now what I'm probably going to do is just use my drill for a moment, why not, right? All right, I'll, I'll tighten these up, make this a little quicker. But, uh, you know, um, another thing, too, if you've watched the channel, um, I'm going to probably not recommend that you wash the deck with a hose. <laughs> I've done it, but to be honest with you, everything I read, <laughs> and a few of you have actually told me, you probably shouldn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now that that's on, I'm going to go ahead and put this on, tighten up this screw here. Now, again, because I am going to tighten this time, I'm going to put this piece back in. I'm going to grab my drill. All right. Put this on. Okay, I'm excited to have this on, you know, let me go ahead and tighten the other guys a little bit more, and then I'm going to do a little hand tightening, which can hurt, man, really, you know, okay, so 11 sixteenths, big boy, okay,
My fiance's here. She's waiting. <laughs> She's like, can I go inside? All right. So, hey, good news. The blade is installed. Couple reminders, like I said, make sure that when you are loosening or tightening that you put something in this hole over here. It's made, it's there for a reason. Okay, right here. All right, so that's kind of a stopper. So if you're tightening, right? And then if you're loosening, you put this here and again, you just, you know, it stops. All right, if this moves, all you gotta do is take a screwdriver, <laughs> put it in there. Okay, um, so again, this is, uh, video's almost done. It's going to be three parts put into one. Um, thanks for watching. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. So you saw that I changed the blade. Obviously, the uh, first test here with the premium mulching blade is here. Okay, um, the grass is cut, as you can see, down to a three, which is definitely a little lower than I usually go. All right, but now right over here on the left side, I'll use the same machine this time, obviously, with the the beast. All right, let me see if I can get that to show, but there it goes. So that is the premium bagging blade, and they say it actually cuts up the grass even smaller. Okay, even smaller. So... And they say you could use it for mulching or you can use it for, for bagging, you know. Uh, so I, I should see, honestly, some more. Um, I should see some more uh, grass and obviously a little cut up smaller. Now they tell you, by the way, to start the mower by raising it a little bit so it doesn't boggle down. I haven't had that issue. But here goes. Let's do this one. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Um just trying to see what I see. So obviously side by side, you know, here as far as cuts concerned. Let's go ahead and grab the bag now and see what the pieces look like. Again, I know people are like, come on, man, show me more. <laughs> so, okay, we're gonna show you more. So these pieces are supposed to be smaller. I don't know. We'll have to take a piece and put it next to a piece. So here you go on the left side is your premium bagging blade. Okay, I don't know why it looks like more grass. It shouldn't, but it looks like it actually cut more. So, you see that, and then let's go over here and you see that. Now, I know I played with this pile a little bit, okay? So that, don't get me wrong, it could be that I spread it out a little bit, all right? But from the top, sorry about that, you see here, and slide across. I mean, honestly, it looks like more grass. So that blade might have cut more grass. Wow. Um, it does look like it has a better angle. So, man, the three is really cutting my grass. Okay, so now I'm looking at the pieces. All right. Just uh, spread them out a little bit so we can see what we're looking at. Right? So, I don't know, it's going to be really hard side by side, but I don't know, these pieces do look smaller in comparison to these guys, you know. I'm trying to just grab like a piece, you know, but you really can't do that because it's not like it cuts every piece exactly the same, you know, but... I'll tell you that the blade, I think because of the angle, it actually cuts a little deeper. So a three with the premium bagging blade versus a three setting with the premium mulching blade, you're definitely going to cut more with the bagging blade. So you might want to go up to a four 
when you're using the premium bagging blade. Um, but I think I'm going to keep this blade on for now. I'll definitely move it back up to a four, but this is definitely more grass. Definitely. You know what I mean? I mean, look at, you know, that's pile and look at this pile and look at it from a height perspective. Okay. And then you look at that one. I mean, yeah. Um, and I think again, it's, it's just because the blade and the way it's positioned will cut deeper into your lawn. So you want to make sure that you have the right height setting. These are both on three. All right. So I think I'm going to keep this blade and use it for a while, but I wanted to show you, and that's, it looked like it was shorter. So as you could see here in the center, I didn't cut in the center, you know, but on the right, you know, I've got the premium mulching blade. But on the left, I used the premium bagging blade. And they both look like they cut pretty good. Uh, but definitely this premium bagging blade um, definitely tears it apart. You know, the two, the two blade system definitely helps. You know, it's definitely allowing you to have two bushels uh, easily in this bag here. So, all right. My next part in this video, and it's not over yet, is I'm going to go over some of the differences in the blades, the part numbers, and what they do. There's another blade that you know about or you don't know about, okay? But uh, listen, hope the video is helpful. I'm going to continue to ask you for thumbs up because it helps the channel. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. And last but not least, again, don't forget, when you start this mower up, make sure you lift it then start it okay otherwise it'll bog down they say uh, you know on, on the grass itself but i'm in love it's honestly a great machine all right any questions any comments let me know have a great day